Bank check, bank check. I can play a duet with myself. Maximum Legacy. Yeah. So 
can we also do it on Instagram? Would it be possible? Uh, I, I, I bet that would confuse that on the computer. And that's, I think it's going to work. Well, we can do it on my phone. That's okay. But um, I would instead like maybe say that go to YouTube and have a better quality. I do. I do. I do. Nobody will watch, but you can tell everyone. Something's there. It's 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 red. Yeah. <laughs> I, my parents didn't watch. I think some of the neighbors didn't watch. Mm -hmm. Nice. Okay, so how the hell is that here? Yeah, I, I'd say I'd say. Well, maybe you could just post a picture with the link on Instagram. I mean, people are. It's not. It's not too difficult for people to click on YouTube these days. Yeah, that's exactly. I would do that too. <laughs> if they want to watch it, they can. They can press two clicks instead of one click. Actually, I wonder, I wonder if you can measure like the effect of that. If it takes two clicks, do you lose like 75% of the people? <laughs> like, it's, it's two clicks. So actually, like, nobody's coming? What? No, not even, I mean, just... Joe's coming. Were you not going to say, I thought you were going to say, oh, Ben. Ah, uh, no, but I wasn't coming because he had like Corona. He actually had it, right? He had it and his like his flatmate now has it, so like it didn't seem too safe. Not sure. Maybe that's gonna be bad. I don't even know where this other guy is. He didn't even call me. <laughs> he thought he really he's not coming. I think he should come. But he told me he's at least at ten after six. He will be polite. But now it's eighteen. I mean I can also start if you want. I mean, anyways, we cannot connect the phone with all this stuff right here. No. Yeah, it's just. It's down, just do it. Yeah. It's just, uh, for for us, anyway. Like, 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 ah, it's in June 23rd. Hey, there you go. There you go. There you go. <laughs> is, it, is it your parents? Probably. Or the neighbors? <laughs> cool. Welcome, everybody. Thanks for watching. It's going to be nice. This keyboard is fucked up. I don't even know how to handle it. <laughs> yeah. I ain't no my pain when I use the German keyboard. <laughs> Six of us now. Almost this dude around me. Okay. Maybe we didn't start and then we are we are good. It's cold. <laughs> so you can't come inside, I guess, but nobody Dylan, you were starting. I started. Yes, it's your turn, right? I should. You just get um, your throw button. Put the coins in the more just in front of the window. <laughs> All right, yeah. I mean, I'm not warmed up. I wanted to sing, but I'm not going to do that. Oh, I'm going to sing it. I'm going to sing it. I'm going to warm up. Okay. Right. okay. You get the audio effect. <laughs> <laughs> so, All right, so uh, um, in Germany, this is heads, right? 
even though this has a head. I would this say has that, a head. This is heads. That's yeah. heads. Yeah. <laughs> it's heads. Okay. okay what so, you got? Um, heads. Heads. You play first. Heads. I play first. All right. So I'm gonna flip, cash, flip, okay. and then whenever we see, yeah. So this. <laughs> you see it? Oh, that's what it is. Okay, okay, let's start. Let's start. <laughs> you don't respect the authority of the no, coin. I just, because you didn't see it. I wanted to give you another check. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. 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 I don't actually, but I will. No, but that's okay. Oh, okay. I'm cool. Come on, this face. Maybe like clear up the other chair so that if somebody else comes, we could. Yeah, at least the arm was coming in like two minutes. Oh, uh, really? Yeah. But so well, it will be they open anyways, right? The, the, the door. Yeah, but if it's two minutes, we can also wait. Oh, you, you can just start. I mean, there's people that are waiting, so I yeah. think it's not worth it to let them forget anymore. Okay. Any other? Okay, guys. <laughs> Okay, so my name is Dylan Wright. Um, <laughs> also known as Art White, which is my new pseudonym. Um, and I'm going to play a few classical pieces. The first two are from Hector Ayala, from the Sweet Americana. Um, uh, the prelude and the piece from Bolivia, whose name I can't remember right now, but <laughs> it's the one from Bolivia. And then I'll play two by Manuel Ponce um, and some and the piece by William Walton. <clears throat> Thank you. 
Maybe we can, we can also change it. And no, but let's close the door maybe after we, all. Yeah, I have. Uh, what? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, I'll play, play two preludes by uh, Manuel Ponce. Thank you. 
Aber erst am Ende. Okay. Hey. Okay, so next, uh, I'm going to play some Bach. 996. First the Allemand uh, and then the Sarabon. <clears throat> Hmm. 
Okay. Next one is a little bit of a Sorgenkind, as we say in German, like a hard piece that I'm not quite sure. Uh, well, it's going to work. But... <laughs> <laughs> Okay, this is uh, my last classical piece. Um, it's a uh, uh, bagatelle number two by William Ball.
can leave my guitar. Okay, I'm going to do one uh, of my own songs, uh, playing and singing. Mm. It's from my project Arc White. Check it out on Instagram. Um, okay, <clears throat> so Arc A R K. Okay, Arc White, <laughs> like Noah's Arc. I did a warm up of my voice. I hope this works. <clears throat> South of my fields. Ah, first of all, I need to retune my guitar. <laughs> Classic. <laughs> what? I'm glad I didn't understand that. <laughs> South of my field lies a heart full of tears Where it eats by the sound of my ear by the sound of my ears Oh, your smell on that sweat I am down for whatever I am down for whatever I am down for whatever for whatever Where all my leaves meet the branch of this tree That's where my heart sits Singing songs of green Singing songs of green Oh, your smile like you please never ever made. Oh, my love, please don't ever ever leave. Ever Ich 
Bestes. Was ein kleines jetzt hier. Okay, ja, ja. 
ich versuche am Anfang ein bisschen zu chillen erstmal. Okay, jetzt neun Leute. to get any connection to these strings right now. It feels not comfortable at all because it's very cold inside. But at the same time, I just don't want to give up and just continue play until I'm... Sounds great. <laughs> I don't know, but I try. Um, uh... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I feel the same way right now. <laughs> this like good comments now positive vibes this is what i need right now no i mean this was second cello suite by bach and i just played the very beginning the prelude first movement and of course i'm not cellist i mean it doesn't sound like cello at all but it's a pretty good transcription i would say and but i didn't do the transcription so
doesn't get any better, but I'm not, I'm not losing any hope right now because I still want to continue. It was from the Five Preludes by Villa Logos, and now you ask me, I think I would even play one more. <laughs> So the first one was number. The second one, no, first I played the fifth one, then there was the second prelude, and now I will continue with the fourth one. inside this room and in the live stream it's 14 people now yeah. maybe I can get it to 15 then I stop playing maybe. Yeah. I really have to be honest like this feeling in my hands right now is so disgusting like it's so <laughs> it's so cold it's so bad and Really, I tried. I... Now it's 15, now I should not. Nah, maybe I play a bit more. <laughs> okay, let's go for it.
So because I'm not getting into the piece, so I just play preludes all the time to get... And so this was a prelude from California Suite by Jose Maria Gallardo del Rey. He's still with us. It's like Spanish composer and he dedicated this one to, to a friend in, in California. And now I continue with another prelude in my set of preludes. Prelude number one by Michael Tröster. Thank mm -hmm. you. 
Someone who can read scores, like everybody can do this in this room, I guess. Like, um, because this is really a struggle right here. This is. Um, <laughs> Oh yeah, back in the days, I like the, I like I like those um, major thing arpeggio kind of. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, my face is like burning. It's like too hot, and my fingers are still like they're like ice. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Okay, let's start it. Um, so I play a fugue now. It's from Violin Sonata by Bach, and it's it's an A minor. It's A minor piece, originally for the for the violin, and this time it's transcribed by Gerhard Reichenbach. It's professor in, in Wuppertal, this guy, and he did a very good job on this piece. I could never do those things, like transcribing a fugue. Okay, I never tried it as well, but, but I don't think I'm good in transcribing. So I think I will want to end this concert how I started it with some Bach. I usually don't play Bach, but right now I feel very sad sometimes and I'm very depressed from all this COVID shit, so I decided to play some Bach today. And I kind of practiced this piece, so I hope it's going good. Like, can you then? Is it good? Okay, let's go. No, I'm okay. You can do it early. No, you can do it late. Yes, and now it's 16 guys for some more, but... Thank you. 
Choices, but I'm not pretty sure what I what I really want to play now. There's a lot of stuff I could. I don't think I play this major thing, but I can play it for you later on. Yeah. Is it good? staying at home. Um, I do one more for the end. And then Kevin is gonna play a wonderful, amazing, powerful set. Right? Maybe. Maybe. Yeah. <laughs>
That's it. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. Now Kevin is the third of us and he's playing the final set. And I'm looking forward, like I'm into it. You really be disappointed. No. <laughs> I mean, we can get drunk now, you know? Like, I'm, I'm, I'm drunk. But it's a good feeling. I haven't played for people or in front of people since March, so I messed up a lot today. But I will get back into it, into the feeling of playing for people. And I thank you all so much that you were here with me today and that I got the opportunity to play for people. And really, some people showed up. I, I didn't expect that at all, that people will have time for this live stream. Okay, now I'm done with talking and Kevin starts to play. Let's go. So that's very small piece. It's some meditation kind of. <laughs> I probably peaked. Sorry, buddy. <laughs> I noticed that when you when you started doing the strumming, but Dylan and I immediately looked at the at the free app because it was like yeah, it was, it was a little bit, yeah. <laughs> yeah it's okay. We got 16 people watching. Can't leave me hanging. so nice. Okay. Um. Thank you, Dylan. <laughs> Thank you, four people. <laughs> Lovely to do this with you guys, even though yeah, it's right. crazy, crazy times. Uh, to the every all the German audience, it's my fault that we're all speaking English. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> um, I'm gonna I'm gonna try something a bit different this time around, and uh, so you guys work with me a little bit. Um, there's this uh, poet that I really like. His name is uh, David White. And uh, when he recites his poems, he, uh, um, he'll, he'll like say a line and then he'll just repeat it. He'll say a line and he'll just repeat it like that. See? <laughs> and somehow it's like, it's like, it's more important, you know? Uh, but it's really cool because, uh, you know, there's a lot of content in a poem. There's a lot of content and uh, uh, it's, it's hard to catch the first time around. And you know, you'll be thinking about the last thing he said and, and he's already saying the next thing. I think that has a lot of similarity with uh, when we play these pieces. There's so much content in this classical music uh, that honestly, like, I feel like most listeners, if they're not familiar with the work yet or they're not very familiar with the style, then they will, they will just kind of, their eyes will glaze over and they'll get lost. And um, I kind of want to, um, I want to try something to combat that. So, um, so first, um, I haven't really thought about what I'd start with, but I'm going to start with the the West Montgomery piece. Um, it's actually, it's not. It was so here. I'll, I'll try to explain a little bit. So in jazz, what you do, uh, you take you take a song, you take the melody, uh, and you rewrite the chords. Uh, it's called a reharmonization. Uh, it's just a way to uh, I don't know, kind of like flex, <laughs> make, it, uh, uh, make it sound really cool. So uh, this piece I'm going to play is not written by Wes Montgomery, but he wrote all the chords. Uh, he, he, wrote, he changed all the chords from what they originally were. Um, so I, I'll try, we'll see how this works. Um, first, I'll, I'll play the melody, which is actually, it's a really beautiful melody. It's really simple. Um, it's just a... Uh, Uh, so you'll hear that hopefully there's a little intro and then I'll play that with the chords um, and it's cool because like like 
every every core change is like there's so much again there's so much information in the core change like like uh it's just like this is like uh, you barely have to do anything with it you barely have to play it it just like the emotion just comes out of it and so uh and then there's one thing i want to point out actually uh this might be a really bad idea but i'm just going to play the ending real quick <laughs> uh, because I'll try to play with a little more uh, nuance. But uh, I think it's absurdly beautiful because of the last chord that it ends on. Uh, you would expect this chord. It sounds really final. Uh, but instead we get... It's the wrong bass note. Uh, yeah, but uh, I think it's genius the way it did it. So actually all three chords just have A in the bass. The typical use of this chord is to create tension, uh, but he uses this as his final chord. And this is like a really good example of the, of the innovation of jazz harmony. This is, you don't have to end on a period, actually. You can, you can end on confusion. You also have to talk to those people. Oh, they can hear me. Are they, are they still there? Is anybody? Uh, See, this guy talks too much. <laughs> so I will tune real quick and then I'll play some. That's oh, another cool thing. Wes Montgomery only plays with his thumb. I mean, he's dead now, but uh, back in the day. So actually, all of these. Yeah, yeah. All these. Uh, all these chords are like strum. I won't do exactly that, but I'll do something like it. Let me show you. Okay. Did you feel the ending better? Yeah. We're saying it's out of tune the whole time. It's a really nice tone, anyways. Nice fleshy tone. Yeah, fleshy
Try the same thing again, although I'll say it quite a bit less. Uh, I'm going to play uh, Chanson de Fatuo Fuego from uh, the hell's that guy's name? Uh, Manma de Faya. Uh, it's pretty cool. Uh, it works. It's actually for orchestra and a singer. It's been adapted for guitar by a guy whose name I also forgot. Uh, but I think um, it makes sense to hear the melody first because actually it's really cool when it's sung. Imagine like a, a woman singer, like like real full of emotion. No I'll play. <laughs> because it's nice and slow. <laughs> Just five. <laughs> Only ten first.
Can't actually. I've never played this one. <laughs> Skip that out. Uh, okay. Um, actually, this this won't be too interesting for everybody in this room. But if there's anybody still out there, uh, I'm going to play a piece that's actually just an etude. It's a tremolo etude. Um, I love tremolo because I think it's uh, you can't do it really on any other instrument as a solo instrument. It's a, you kind of cheat. You use uh, these three fingers to pretend it's a voice because like, well, you'll see. <laughs> uh, it sounds like people often, uh, if they're not familiar with the guitar, they'll say, oh, it sounds like, it sounds like two people. Like, how is it possible? Uh, which is why it's really fun. <laughs> All right. And I can't complain that my hands are, oh, they are cold. This is ridiculous. It's like, it's like sweating and my hands are cold. It's, <laughs> it's not fair. Huh? Fear. 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 Yeah. Oh, yeah. What a what an unfortunate development. <laughs> Why would it be like that? You know, like you get afraid and your hands go cold. Yeah. Doesn't make sense. So you don't die in the water. But you need your hands. Depends how bad it is. Like it's already at a point where you just need your. I guess, uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, let's see. If it sucks at first, I will start over because it's like five minutes long. I don't want to play shitty for five minutes. <laughs> Thank you. 
This is everybody is here. It's first live stream. Thank Hope you. it went well.
yeah, that's just the <laughs> Stay safe, guys. Stay tuned. And be positive, even though we're in trouble lockdown now. It was a pleasure to see you, and we'll see each other soon. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you.